banking sector where various banks in the country are re-strategizing to protect customers and staff against the outbreak of COVID-19. Now this follows a directive from the Bank of Ghana for all financial institutions in the country to reactivate their business continuity and recovery plans in the wake of the outbreak. COVID-19 is having a toll on financial institutions across the world. The Bank of Ghana has already directed banks to institute the necessary measures against the virus. Here, at the head office of the Universal Merchant Bank, personal hygiene has been skilled up. Communication and marketing officer for Sinapia tells me customers are safe. The sensitization started about two weeks ago mm. and in branch we provided sanitizers, gloves, the mask, which is quite a deviation from the normal banking procedure, but it is very important that we do it so that customers feel protected, our staff also feel protected. Customers are impressed. It was okay because before I heard the news around, going around, um, I'm okay having this thing to protect myself. When I got in, I noticed that the sanitizer was there, so at least it feels, I feel a bit more safer using the sanitizer and for touching stuff and everything. Because I came with my kids, so I think it's a good thing. The Securities and Exchange Commission has also directed all investment banks and others to suspend AGMs and other gatherings and observe proper hygiene. The situation is not different at the head office of Data Bank. Group Chief Marketing Officer Gillian Hammer tells me it is part of moves to ensure protection. There's no point a client coming into Data Bank and there are six relationship managers. One is in a mask or two are in masks and the others aren't. It, there has to be some level of consistency where maybe the president may need to give that directive as well. But for now, we don't think it's necessary. We think the better focus is to make sure people wash their hands. 